In Southern Africa, about 85% of the soils on which crop plants, including beans, are grown suffer from low levels of the form of phosphorus, known as available phosphorus, which plants can access and absorb. As a result, bean growth is poor with low yields. This video shows us why new kinds of beans being developed by the Mozambique Institute of Agricultural Research are able to give better yields in soils low in available phosphorus. In the types of field where crops, including beans, are grown, most of the available phosphorus is found in the upper layers of soil. When ordinary bean varieties grow, the taproot and its relatively fewer branches generally extend downwards. Only a few other roots, called adventitious roots, develop at the base of the stem. These varieties of beans are therefore not very efficient at taking up the available phosphorus that is mostly found in the upper layers of soil. The result is poor growth and poor yields. The bean varieties under development at IIAM are different. As these varieties grow, the taproot forms many branches that spread outwards through the soil. In addition, many other roots, the adventitious roots, develop at the base of the stem and invade the uppermost layers of soil. The roots of these new varieties also have long root hairs that increase the area of the root surface through which phosphorus is absorbed. These hairs exclude more of the acidic chemicals that dissolve phosphorus and other nutrients so that these are easily taken up by the plant. This special root structure means that these new bean varieties are far better able to exploit the low levels of available phosphorus in the upper layers of the soil. Therefore, these bean varieties can thrive and produce good yields. Currently, six new phosphorus efficient bean varieties are in the final stages of official release by IIAM's Directorate of Agronomy and Natural Resources. Once these have been released, interested growers and seed companies can obtain basic seed of the new bean varieties through the unit of basic seed. Useba. IIAM, in collaboration with Pennsylvania State University under the Feed the Future program, USAID, and the Collaborative Crops Research Program, the McKnight Foundation, is investigating the link between drought tolerancy and phosphorus efficiency. We aim to develop bean varieties combining these features soon.